What's up guys? Michael the Wild here with the Wild Lane Media. We are a business and media consulting agency specializing in all things creative. Uh, everything from web design, video pre and post production, audio pre and post production. Uh, we have a full integrated CRM website builder for our clients to use aside from us building, run ads, we uh, manage people's social media, you name it, we do it. Like I said, all things creative, all the fun stuff. So today I'm gonna go th run through one of our clients and uh, just making a social media post for them. Super simple, go ahead and uh, stay tuned. <laughs> stay tuned. Let's get into it. I'm gonna take you over there. Super simple. Another thing for um, a lot of you uh, new creators out there to consider all the fluff, all the fluffy gear and all the fancy stuff that you feel like you may need to, to do this and to make videos and stuff is not needed by any means. Not needed at all. I have a tripod, very simple tripod and my phone. That's all you really need. Don't worry about your gear, just create. Okay, let's see. Let's put you right here. Perfect. All right. So we are on Facebook. This is the client, Next Level Solutions. They are a general contracting company. Here's what their branding is looking like these days. So we have this nice um, kind of cutting edge um, design. We, we stick with the blue and orange for now. The blue is a primary color in their logo. So, and we alternate between photos and professional branded graphics. And so it can be real photos of their work and then professionally branded graphics. We use a nice mix of both so that um, it's not overly branded. This is a, a small business that has a big look to it and they're real people amazing people. I actually went to high school with this gentleman and um, they perform amazing work, but you don't want to look too big and look too corporate because that will, you know, stray some people away. So you want to make sure it's authentic. So a nice mix of everything is a good way to go. Um, since our last post was a graphic, this post that we're going to be making this time is actually going to be a um a photo so and i haven't been able to get out to do a video shoot with them so i'm going to just go to envato real quick and download a cool remodel of a bathroom or or something like that this is gorgeous i think i just used this one not too long ago let's see Where are we at? That's the unfortunate thing sometimes is you can look through stock photography and video websites all day long. So don't get too caught up on it. Find a good photo and just push past it. Keep pushing. This is nice. This is very nice. And this is work that they could perform. This is a little, looks like it's from Europe or somewhere. Um, let's see. Doesn't really say. Uh, should we do it? Should we do it? Let's do it. Download, download, download. Boom. So we're going to make sure this goes into the correct folder, into the correct folder, next level solutions. Boom. And first things first, we're going to open up Photoshop. Now, when you are in Photoshop, often, excuse me, not worried about Photoshop. We're actually going to um, be utilizing social pilot, which is an automation software for social media, right? And so with social pilot, it comes with its pros and cons overall, I a plus software like it, uh, especially for the price in comparison to its competitors, Hootsuite or Hootsuite, whatever. Um, I think it's Hootsuite. <laughs> um, yeah, you just can't, there's no reason to pay extra for nothing. So, Social Pilot is the way to go if you're looking for an automation software. 
um, that is fairly vast. They have multiple, multiple social platforms available to post directly to all from one place. Um, if you're looking for something more simple and don't need to go to as many platforms, uh, there's cool uh, GoDaddy integration with your website and things like that. Um, but overall, if you need a very vast social media automation uh, software, Social Pilot is a great place to start. Control O to open. We're going to find the folder we need. So we're in Photoshop Control O. Sorry, this camera is kind of in my way. Let's go next level solutions. Let's find the photo that we just downloaded. Now, when using Social Pilot, which is why I originally brought it up, um, often, sometimes the photo sizes can be very large and the compressor in the software doesn't work as adequately as I would like. And sometimes the posts fail. Now, over time, it's gotten much better and much better. But uh, Instagram, for instance, I think Facebook has a five megabyte max. So I pull the photo up. I'm going to press control, uh, alt shift control W or shift control alt W. And right away, it's going to show me that the width and height here, and then it's the file size is actually 1.5 megs. So we're 3.5 under, which is great, but it's also a very large photo and taking up lots of storage. So just for etiquette today, I'm going to bring it down to 1920 and it's 1920 by 1280 and increase. And so it's 706.5 kilobytes now. So we've reduced it a lot, which is great because, you know, storage. And I'm going to save over it. So just save, make sure you're in the right folder. And then um, for Instagram, you need the social square. I don't know, guys. We'll do something like that. Kind of on the third here it was a nice area. Okay, so Shift Control Alt W again to export. It's gonna again show you your size. I just don't need it that large, and I don't want to waste that much space. 1080 by 1080, 135 kilobytes. Export, um, and then I will rename this. I just add SQ at the end for square. Control W to exit out of this. No changes needed. Let's go into the internet and get going. So next level solutions. I'm going to go back to their Facebook. I'm going to copy some of the relevant hashtags and uh, their phone number and website to just copy and paste that over now. Okay. Well, you can, I normally will use, I know I wouldn't say normally, I'll normally use an automation software software that will help me write. So you can go here. This is called uh, Copymatic. So, you know, if I'm struggling with writing, then I'm going to go ahead and head into Copymatic and, and try and write something up. So we're just going to go our audience, everyone, product name. Let's see. Next. Next level solutions. Okay. Are you considering a bathroom remodel? Question mark. Well, comma, if you are, you've come to the right place. Boom, period. Let's see, generate. Let's see what it comes up with for us. Design an installation company that specializes in bathroom renovations. In you obviously need to change this. Our designers and contractors will transform your home into something you love. Copy. So we'll copy that. Paste it over. Next level solutions is a design installation. And you totally have to revamp this. You cannot rely solely on Copymatic to write your good copy. Design installation and contracting company. Perfect. That specializes in bathroom renovations in Brentwood, California. Uh, in Contra Costa County. 
Northern <laughs> California. California. Boom. Our design, our designers and contractors will transform your home into something you love. Okay, good place to start. Let's keep going. Tired of that. That's old looking bathroom. Embarrassed with with that once white grant uh grout. Uh tired of that old looking bathroom. Fine. Grout that is now yellowing. Let's just leave. let's just try it. <laughs> Let us design your perfect bathroom. We offer what uh, with quality craftsmanship finishing. You're guaranteed the best. We'll we'll just use this one, and we're gonna use this one too. Home and office. Boom. 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 Okay. Next level solutions is a design installation and contracting company that specializes in bathroom renovations in Northern California. Our designers and contrast contractors will transform your home into something you love. Let us design your perfect new bathroom. We offer a wide range of designs and styles to choose from with quality craftsman craftsmanship and finishing. You're guaranteed the best. I don't know if you really need the excessive capitalization on this, uh, um, it's good to use in opening your copy. Uh, it's actually good to use in like certain ways. So like I would say here at the beginning of the post, are you tired of that old bathroom? One thing to really pay attention to in um, when using social pilot is when you misspell capitalized words, it will not show you that it's misspelled. So you really have to pay attention when you're using capitalization. Sorry, social pilot. Are you tired of that old bathroom? Question mark. Next level solutions. Okay, boom. Let's go back to where we were. You're guaranteed the best. Introducing the most sophisticated. Let's go ahead and not make a whole new paragraph here. Introducing the most sophisticated, high quality, long lasting material for your bathroom. Next level solutions. Specialize. Specialists, eh, I don't like this. So just uh, the last sentence, the final sentence, next level solutions, comma, specialists in home and office. Specializes, specializes in home, let's say office, retail, and commercial remodeling, modeling, and ground up construction. Boom, okay, start my remodel now. Another call to action. Start my remodel now, we can get rid of call now. Start my remodel now, boom, boom, boom. I think we're good. I think we're good. Okay, now let's get back to that photo. We're going to go here. So you press this icon here um, and you can also press here. When you post a URL in Social Pilot, it's going to automatically pull up a graphic from the desired URL that you're visiting. So because we typed in the URL first, it pulls up the desired graphic. So we're going to get rid of that. You don't have to get rid of it but it sometimes does cause an error. They say to upload the photo first. So I'm gonna go here, upload photo. We're going to go to Next Level Solutions. We're going to 1920 by 1080. There we go. So this is for the primary Facebook, Twitter, LinkedIn, Google My Business, and Instagram. Now on Instagram, you need to go to the Instagram tab, remove the the regular aspect ratio and put in your social square your 1080 by 1080 or 1920 by 1920 
So we're gonna add that graphic there. So we have the social square on Instagram. We're gonna select the account we would like to post it to. And voila, Viola. So we're gonna schedule this for, let's go to, let's go three, oops, three. I like odd numbers. Not necessarily odd, just not, uh, when you click through the hour, it'll do it on increments of five, five, 10, 15. Um, and the social platforms do not want us using social uh, automation software. They want people on their platform. They want people to just be there and be hands-on and be on the platform. So um, I tried to trick the algorithm by doing odd numbers. So it's it already knows it's coming from social pilot, so it really doesn't matter. But let's do 313. Actually, 13 is supposed to be a bad number, huh? Let's do 311. Schedule posts. And that is me posting a post for a client. What you think about that? Next level solutions, general contracting and ground up construction. Badass company great quality. Check them out. Check them out. Michael the Wild here to Wild Lane Media. I am glad that you guys have watched this video. I hope you learned a little something. And I know it's kind of all over the place because I'm showing you the full process. So take it for what it is. Photoshop, Social Pilot, Copymatic, Facebook. Um, yeah, you don't really need Facebook at all. <laughs> Social Pilot, Copymatic, Adobe Photoshop, boom! Enjoy, Michael DeWild, I'm out.